Hey guys, welcome back to No Catchy Name. It's me, Ella. Today is July the 5th. Uh, yesterday was Independence Day. It was a lot of fun. I hope everybody had a safe holiday and fun and all that stuff. Anyways, this is my movie squares for J, K, and L. <laughs> so I'm just going to go through them real quick because I only have a few minutes to record. <laughs> but my J movie was the original Jumanji with Robin Williams in it. And for it, I made this one. That's a door. It's a door from the house. <laughs> My favorite scene is when the cop and the aunt are at the door and then the flood <laughs> from the monsoon like breaks the doors down and they go floating down the street <laughs> on the doors. I love that part. And then like those alligators are passing by and they're screaming. <laughs> I just love that part. But uh, so I made the door. Yeah, I put the texture on there. I thought it was cute. It is so glary. <laughs> but that is my um, J square. Just used some scrap yarns. It's all Red Heart, Super Saver, uh, Cafe Latte, White, and Delph Blue. Then for my K-movie, I did A Knight's Tale, which I love that movie. It's not really a family-friendly movie, which I've been trying to do. But uh, the day that I watched it, I was kind of feeling under the weather. And I wanted to just lay down and watch a movie, so I picked it. And this one looks a little funny. But I made a lance. It's called a lance. Hello. <laughs> all that part. But I just used um, just cherry red because the cover of the movie is red and black. And then I tried to copy the, one of the lances that he uses on the part where he takes his helmet off um, to do the joust. <laughs> and Because it's green and black. But it doesn't look perfect, but I know what it is. So it doesn't matter if anyone else doesn't. <laughs> and then for Ale, um, I did the Little Mermaid. <laughs> the old... Um, gosh, when did that come out? I can't remember if that was... Came out in the late 80s or early 90s. But it's the Disney movie. And um, I was going to do Luca, but I couldn't think of what to do a square for. So I decided to go with Little Mermaid. So I made a mermaid. <laughs> I didn't have purple to use as her shells in my scraps, so I just used a blue color. But this is a really cute uh, pattern. This I did use a pattern for. I'll link it below. I can't remember. It's called Mermaid Garland because you're supposed to make a bunch of them connect them together. And it was free, but I can't remember who made it because I just made it really quickly. All scraps again. But uh, yeah, so that's my... J, K, and L squares. So I'm caught up. Now I gotta do the double feature, which is gonna be M and N. And I'm not sure what I'm gonna watch for them. <laughs> I got to figure out what movies I wanna watch and uh, figure out what I wanna do for them. But yeah, I like this because her hair is like loose. So on my blanket, it's gonna be like a dangly curly cue. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I'm really loving this so far. I just fell behind from being sick and stuff. But I'm doing a little bit better now. And uh, yeah, so. I'm caught up. Woo I feel accomplished that I got caught up. <laughs> but um, I'll probably fall behind again, I'm sure, especially around the holidays because I'll be so busy doing holiday stuff. But uh, that's okay. We'll figure it out. We'll get it done before the end of the year. Maybe. <laughs> we'll see. But yeah, I also wanted to mention two people asked. One person asked about what a snake plant was. So I'm going to insert a picture of my snake plant. And it's also called Mother-in-Law's Tongue <laughs> by, um, you know, it's like uh, a nickname for it. And then a couple people asked about the popsicle cozies, how to use them. So I'm going to pop a picture of the type of popsicles you use them with and how, you know, how you use them. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I just wanted to pop those in there. So I'll put that in the title of this too so the people who ask that know that it's in this video. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I just took those pictures. I started a new whip yesterday. It's a blanket out of the yarn that I got on clearance at Hobby Lobby. So I've, I've already put almost two whole balls into it and I got six. So I'm going to try to just use all the yarn that I bought. And uh, yeah, I haven't worked on my amigurumi because I don't like how big it's coming out. I might rip it out and restart it um, with a smaller hook. I thought I was using an elf hook on it. And then when I st sat down to work on it again, I realized I was using a G hook. So I might be one reason it's a little bit bigger than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> but um, yeah, I'm probably going to rip that out. I don't know. I haven't made up my mind yet. We'll see. <laughs> But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and hop off here and get this video edited and up for you guys because it's already like three or four weeks late. Anyways, so I'm gonna hop off here and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye guys.